famous for sweets also, and we have chocolates that are called bachi, which means kiss. And then we have Nutella with piadina, which is really a delicious thing to eat. Diese Wurst kommt aus Krakow. Deshalb heißt sie Krakauer Wurst. Man isst sie mit Brot, aber auch ohne. And here we have a potato bread. It includes potato, and in Finland we eat very much potato. So. Das heißt mince pies, and this is a typical Weihnachtsessen for Finland. It's typically typical Christmas foods that we eat. Yeah, no Christmas, obviously. Well, we have I don't know the English word. It's called kraut. It's sour crowd and um, typically it's eaten um, with other food as well. Um, and it's warm, but sadly it's cold today, but try it anyway. And then we have this um, special cheese and it's, well, it's nice, you should try it, but many people don't like it. <laughs> but it's typical for Hessen and especially for Frankfurt. Because everywhere is a river, near river is a cathedral, and near cathedral is market. And I think that in all European cities it's the same. And after it, the city will improve their... Yes. Okay, so this is Frankfurt. And Frankfurt, in Frankfurt are living 650,000 people and it was built thanks to the mine and is divided into 16 quarters right now. Um, Frankfurt is the major financial center and has got the biggest airport in Europe. Uh, so Ravenna is the oldest city and it was founded in the 89 uh, BC uh, by Romans. And here we can see some, uh, some historical monuments. Uh, that are influenced by Romans and Byzantine, and Ravenna is uh, is famous for for its mosaics uh, all around the world. Uh, so the Poznan is one of the biggest cities in Poland, and it's in the western part of Poland, so you can see on the map. Uh, it's located on the Warta River. Uh, on these pictures uh, down there, down there uh, we can see how uh, the development of our city. It was destroyed during the Second World War, and it has, has to be uh, rebuilt. So, uh, as you know, our topic is about everything in the 70s, and so um, my topic was um, to imagine how young people spend their time in the, what people, like what the youngsters did in their free time, and so we were just imagining what people did in Italy, what people did in Germany, and what people did in Poland. Basically, the start with music. Music was very similar in all the countries. Um, a very long list of names, which I'm not going to go through. All blonde hair, 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 bl
Als wir waren der Workshop Nummer 7, wir hatten als Aufgabe die Vorbereitung der Messe in Poznan, Polen. Im nächsten Jahr haben wir unsere Poster, die sagen, was wir in den 6 Tagen in Poznan in Spring. Thanks for all for all your work. 